It's time for the show that engages with people of the combat sports world. And now, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed combat sports show champion of the world, Flash Knockdown! Welcome everyone, and thank you for joining me on episode 21 of Flash Knockdown with the undefeated father. And this is still my boy! Cameron Killer Cam! That's fucking weird, huh? Chamberlain! Welcome to the show, Cameron. Welcome, thank you. Thanks for having me. You're welcome. How how are you? Not bad as yourself. I'm very well, brother. Very well. Thank you very much for asking me. And the question that everyone watching will want to know, does the nickname Killer Cam get a thumbs up? Or does it get a thumbs down? It gets a thumbs up! Oi, oi! <laughs> Oy, oy. Love it, love it. So that's, keep that one. You're gonna keep that one. Maybe, maybe. Whoa, <laughs> love it, love it. Killer Cam in the building, and uh, and for the benefit of the viewers, Cameron is two and zero so far in 2021, and he'll be back at it this back at it again this coming weekend on Saturday, the 18th of September, at Almighty 19. A fight that we will preview very shortly. How has training been for you this time round, Cameron? It's, it's been great. Like I said, um, like you said before, I've fought back to back now, haven't I? And um, yeah, it's been, I've only had like three weeks since my last fight, and so it's just back to back. Consistency is key in it. So yeah, there's not much of a camp. I've never had a training camp ever. I'm fit year round and. Yeah. Proper athlete. Just keep the ball rolling. Yeah. That's 100%. right. Yeah, man. Keep keep the momentum going. That's what it's all about. No <laughs> days off. No days off. <clears throat> no days off. Cool. Okay, Cameron. And before we go any further, my man, please could you give the viewers an overview of your MMA career, the gym you represent, and how people can find you online, please. Yeah, well, my name's Cameron Chamberlain. I represent uh, Matrix MMA out of Oldham, right in Oldham. And um, my record's five and seven, I think, I believe. And uh, yeah. Okay, and how can people find you online? Uh, Facebook, Cameron Chamberlain. Uh, Instagram's Cameron underscore official 21, I think. I could Perfect. be wrong, but yeah. Don't worry, it's on, it's on your handle at the bottom right now. Oh, no worries. <laughs> Good stuff, Cameron. Thank you very much. And we now move on to the next part of the show that I've called Flash Choices. Oh, oh we've got a Ray Lewis by the championship of Jones. For first time viewers, I will ask Cameron 10 questions with two possible answers and Cameron you choose the one that best suits in a flash got it sound started <laughs> sound as a pound lad uh I'm not sure what you're talking about first one Cristiano Ronaldo or Paul Scholes Paul Scholes gotta be the olden boy yeah yeah and uh, <laughs> do you have a favorite Paul Scholes moment um p p you know favorite goal i know there's been i know there's many to choose from i know yeah too many I'll give me one <laughs> give me one give me one his what about his goal against barcelona in the uh in the yeah, semi-finals yeah yeah. yeah 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 i remember that well yeah that was a good one or oh, the, the other one that comes to mind was the one against uh bradford's 
It was uh, from a corner and it was just a full volley from, from a corner. Not sure if yeah, you remember actually, that one. Yeah, I do remember that actually as well, yeah. yeah. No, I, I'll Still answer questions time. and and I'll, and I'll answer for you as well. That's fucking illegal. <laughs> <laughs> and um, what did you make of Ronaldo's debut? Or second debut on the weekends? I wasn't watching, I was training, if I'm being honest. No, I didn't watch it. I heard he looked good though. Yeah. I mean, he always looks good, doesn't he? So yeah, man. He's just a Glad wicked athlete, back. isn't he? He's a freak. Yeah, Glad to have him back. Yeah. 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 Okay. So stick him with your beloved Manchester United Cameron. The <laughs> class, the class of 99 or 2008? 2008. That okay. was not my era, wasn't it? <laughs> True. You had uh, Tevez, Rooney and Ronaldo. Yeah, everybody. That yeah. Was, that was a good year. Yeah, do you think better than York and, York and Cole? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay, third one in Cameron. Featherweights or bantamweights? Featherweights. <laughs> Never again to bantamweight, no? Never. <laughs> Never. For a, unless it was for a belt, I would. Because I'm, I'm a small featherweight, I'm not, I'm not huge, but I, I train with a lot bigger featherweights. There's a lot bigger featherweights out there, and I'm all this. I'm, it's just because of my, my frame is big, so bantamweight and featherweight because I'm quite tall. So that's the only reason I've moved up as well, and I'm comfortable. I don't okay. have to, I diet, but yeah, not too bad. Good, all right. So sticking with the featherweights, Cameron? Brian Ortega or Alex Volkanovsky? Ortega. Oh! His grappling is slick, isn't it? He's, he's a little boy, isn't he? He's, he's yeah, he's Jiu-Jitsu, Gracie Jiu-Jitsu, right? Yeah. Wow. Wow. So, you, so you, you're going for him at uh, ufc 266 instead of uh, vulcan the current champ the the undisputed champ yeah I'd, yeah i put my bets on him really yeah and um how 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 do you see that fight finishing submission uh, oh he's got really good boxing these days hasn't he? he's improving every fight so you never know it's a crazy sport so, anything yeah. can happen Okay, we'll talk about submissions. Guillotine choke or rear naked choke? Mm, rear naked choke. Has okay. to be the lion killer, isn't it? 100%. You the got, big boys out there. <laughs> absolutely. You got that against um, uh, Adam Gomez in your last fight. Yeah. Yeah. How, how, how does it feel when, you, when another man taps? Clap like chicken. can't describe it it's, it's different like yeah it's something it's special yeah special yeah. to me 100 percent. yeah special feeling man making another man quit yeah yeah wow lucky you sixth one then cameron the rematch with rob mcnee mcnee or versus jj jones I think me and JJ Jones could fight. I'm a bit bigger than him at the minute, but um, Rob Mitney, if I remember correctly, uh, I'd get that one back. You get that one? Any particular reason? Uh, I took the fight on a week's notice. Uh, I was young, immature, and I think I'd smash him now. So yeah, you know <laughs> why that. Not? You know that. Yeah. You know that. Done now. Okay, seventh one. Then sorry, sorry, mate. What was that? I said 100% I'd win. No 100%. Doubt. No doubt about that. Yeah, man. You've made you've made significant improvements. I mean, you were probably, yeah. what, only 16 when you, when you fought Rob? Yeah, 16, 17, yeah. That's what I'm saying. You were just a boy. You're a man now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. a lot more immature. I mean, not uh, mature, sorry, and experienced is the main thing. Especially at amateurs. That's one thing that gets me. Sorry to interrupt. No, 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 please. See, 
This is your floor. Uh, ami- amateur boxers. They have 100 plus fights at amateur before even thinking about turning professional. And then you get amateur MMA guys and it's like they have five fights and turn over to professional and they'll get smashed. And it's, it gets me. I don't, I don't understand it. I never will, I don't think. Do you have an idea in, in, or do you have a number in mind in terms of the number of fights you have? Because you're on 12 now. I think you've got your 13 from Saturday. Is there a number? Is there a number in mind before you make that switch? Uh, not necessarily. I think I'll have about 20. 20, wow. 25. For real? Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. I think well, that's that... a good number. Okay, well, then that means you're going to be in the amateurs for at least the next two years, maybe three years. That's it. I don't, I don't know. The way I'm going, I'm, I'm fighting regular now, so... Yeah, every month. And I think I can... Yeah, I can beat a lot of guys, and I'm staying injury-free. So why not? Yeah, man. Just go wow. with it. Wow. Wow. Love that. Love that. Okay. Seventh one, then, Cameron. The 11th of September, 2016. Or the 19th of June, 2021? 19th of June. That was your first MMA win as a father? Yeah. Versus? Alistair. Alistair. That's right. Yeah, yeah, Alistair, yeah. A- Alistair Fitzharris. I'm going to say Alistair Overy, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, Alistair Overy, calm down, mate. Pump the brakes, pump the brakes. Pump the brakes, yeah, pump the brakes. <laughs> you wouldn't want to fight him. No, no chance, no chance. Like I said, you're, I you're good, it. but, you know, you, you, can't, you can't match up to, to Overy. I'm sorry, you're not there yet, Cameron. There's levels, isn't there? There is levels, and there's, and there's also weights. Yeah, he's a lot he- He's a lot heavier than you. Yeah, just a bit. Uh, yeah, just just a little bit. A little fun fact about Overeem. He was born in London in Hounslow. Don't know if you knew yeah, that. Yeah, you, you knew that. Okay, yeah. yeah, there you go. There you go. All right. The the eighth one, then um, Cameron, Spider-Man or Superman? Spider-Man. It has to be, uh... your boy. Your boy is a big fan of Spider-Man, right? Yeah, well, he hasn't got much toys, Spider Man or anything, but I think he will when he's a bit older. Yeah. Okay. Didn't I see him in a, in a Spider Man's outfit the other day? Yeah, he's got a swimming costume. I've just got oh, him. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Yeah. See, I do my research, brother. Yeah, I'm gonna take him swimming soon. Probably after the fight. Now. Good. Yeah, of course. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Nice one. All right. Ninth one, then Cameron. Dan Henderson or Vitor Belfort? Vitor Belfort. Raw, okay. Um, did you see his fight on the weekend versus Holyfield? Yeah. Was, yeah? Uh, What'd you make of that? I'm not, I'm not gonna speak on it. It's a bit daft in it, what they're doing over there, but it's what it is. Yeah. Puts bums in seats, doesn't it? So yeah and what what what, um again just like the question before any any favorite fight moment concerning vitor in his mma career i mean he's Uh, had lots when he fought john jones yeah when he fought john jones he looked good didn't he he nearly tapped him with the armbar and stuff if i remember correctly yeah um yeah and he's always been one tough guy on it crazy crazy from a young age Yeah, yeah yeah They don't make him like he used to. Yeah, yeah, for for real. But I I, I did think you were going to choose Dan Henderson because didn't I see a picture with you and Henderson one day? Yeah, long, long time ago. (laughs) Long, long time ago. You're probably wondering. Yeah. Where was that? Was that in London? Or Uh, Manchester? Manchester, I think. Yeah, when he fought Bisping. Bisping. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Yeah, so I'm walking about and I thought get a picture with him a legend, you're kidding so. you just saw him walking about yeah i was there with my teammate at the time and we saw him i'm like was that dan <laughs> that, i think so yeah we went over and got a picture i would have done the same thing yeah. Yeah, top guy 
Top guy, absolutely top, and another legend. Yeah, of course. Yeah. All right, the tenth and final one, then Cameron. Workout seven a.m. or seven p.m. P.m. Oh, not, you're I'm a p.m. boy. Person. You're not a morning person. Damn, most oh. people choose the morning. Nah, well, I spend time with my son in the morning, so yeah. Yeah, that time's safe. Still train. Still train twice a day, but when I can, like my little boy's priority. So amazing. Yeah. And do you, do you do you ever see Arthur perhaps being a martial artist himself, even even if it's just for fun? Not not saying pursue it as a career, but would you be open to that? Yeah, hundred percent. I think he'll do some sort of grappling for sure, just for self defense or. People need you need it these days, don't you? Exactly. I think it should be in schools everywhere, everywhere around the country, well around uh, the world. I couldn't agree more. I couldn't yeah. agree more. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it teaches you more than just defending yourself. It teaches you how you know respect, discipline. Yeah, you know, and you meet different kinds of people from all all walks of life, don't you? That's exactly right. Yeah, no, it's oh. a great shout there, Cameron. Great shout. Yeah. Like and, if I um, want in, yeah. into martial arts, if I want into martial arts, I won't be on here with you. So, true that. One of them, isn't it? True that. That's true. Absolutely. Well, I'm glad that you are, man. Mm. I'm glad that you are. <laughs> and how did you find your flash flash choices overall, Cameron? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Not Good bad. fun. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Great. Great, that's better, that's better, man, that's better, great, that's it, that's great. All right, so as we are days removed from your, from your next walk to the cage, Cameron, let us first begin mm -hmm. there, and at AFC yeah. 19 in Liverpool, you square off against Liverpool's own Michael Evans from Team Cabon, who's on a two-fight mm -hmm. winning streak, with his last appearance coming in March 2020. Can you share what you know about Michael? And where you feel you have the advantage? Uh, well, I know he's been around for a long time, and um, I think he was fighting when I was in school. I think um, he's nine and two or eight and two, good record. So if I beat him, like you said, it could be possibly a title after that, maybe. Um, it's from a quality gym, you know, the killers down there, Team Cowboy. With Darren Till and stuff like that, uh, but I don't see him beating me. Not, not an ounce in my body is he beating me. Not a chance. Because the difference is, he's got this record, but he's fought his journeyman, if you will, his wins are against nobodies, and his losses against one, one guy who I fought, he's, he's decent, and um, another guy I don't remember, but both losses. Are, half decent guys so he ain't beating me no way love it Cam Cameron's come alive ladies and gentlemen I <laughs> love it jeez and what would the significance of a victory at AFC 19 mean especially coming off your decisive win at AFC 18 in August do you think a title shot should follow uh, maybe I I'm not really forced it's a piece of plastic in it at the end of the day, I'm in, I'm in there for experience. This is what amateurs for. I'm not here for little belts or because when you turn pro, it don't matter. Even be like you'd agree with that, wouldn't you? Like no one's gonna remember your amateur record, nothing like that. So I'm in it for the experience and the wins now. So yeah. Okay, and this fight will represent your third in as many months. All things being well, do you think there may be room for one more before the end of the year, Cameron? Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, that would equal more your. I'm sorry. More than one. More, more than one. Yeah, you, you'll see me a lot. Ah, because so um, it, it depends what the coaches say as well. It's not just me, is it? It's, I'd love to fight every month because I don't, well, I don't get hit a lot, so I'm never injured or anything in training. I've got a good team around me, and they're not there to kill me every day. Like you see most gyms not beating each other up all the time, but yeah. Wow. A lot. Yeah, because in, in 2016, you, you made four appearances. That's your record in, 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 in one calendar year. 
So you might you yeah. might even beat that. You might even go for five. Yeah, and that's that's when I was rubbish. If I'm honest with you, I was just young, immature, taking fights I shouldn't have, and I still made that work. And I've never pulled out of a fight. Well, I pulled out one, which we'll get to. But, I was going to uh, say, yeah, don't say anything yet. Yeah. We'll get to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Bro, so, yeah. oh god, I can't wait to hear that answer. So I'm, I'm very intrigued. 